What's up guys? So chest workout today. We have a single RP9. Let's get it. Guys, it's just one of those days where I keep forgetting every single thing. I went upstairs like three times just to make sure I got everything, you know? Forgot my blender bottle, forgot my car keys. I just hate when that all stuff happens, you know? I was planning to not take any pre-workout today because we have a 740 deadlift tomorrow. But I am, since we have an RP9, you know, I'm going to only have one scoop of Gorilla. But here's the kicker. What I have in my hands is I have four pills of Alpha GPC and six pills of Tyrosine. And that's like a Caucasian act, like a, a mix to actually get you stronger, right? This is what I usually use. So we're going to down that. Take one scoop of Nitric and one scoop of Mode. Wow, there's a crack in this. Of course, it's the one I bring. Maybe there's a blender bottle back here. Found one, but it's a little gross. Oh well, oh my gosh, I forgot my juice. See, I'm forgetting everything. You guys cop this limited edition Gorilla and use code Sawyer. Thank you very much. This has actually been my go-to flavor. I kind of like it. I hope they make it actually in public. Not a limited edition. I ain't gonna be going searching for the scooper on this thing, so might as well use the other one. I swear Gorilla Mode Nitric is just OP. I tried using some of Nate's pump stuff that's from uh, whatever it's called, Jack Factory, and it just like didn't give me a pump. Granted, I might have not had enough food in my system at that time, but... We just pulled up, Nathan is gonna come in. I don't know what he's training. See, it's so hot out today. There hasn't been any rain in probably about a month, it seems like. So everything's just super, super dry up in Minnesota. What you got today? <laughs> it happened. You just have legs. Okay. I got squats. No wonder, two scoops today. Oh, what? I got some, uh, what should I try? I, no, I got some nitric. Oh, should I try Wait, no, that's not nitric. It's back there somewhere. I can't reach it. Oh, it's right. Watermelon. Water. I really like watermelon, but that that red is it. Red, white, and blue, or what? Red, what red, white, and stripes. It's actually it's a uh, new flavor, limited edition, volcano something. Volcano okay. burst. Yeah, it's so good. That yeah, I've definitely taken that. It's not a everyday pre-workout. Yeah, it's just a, that's it's a pretty gnarly. that's a PR pre-workout. <laughs> I haven't taken any of this stuff since I hit 770. Oh, did you, really? did you take? Did you get the nature? No, I, I haven't done it.
Hey guys, so today we have deadlifts today. Nothing too crazy. It's Wednesday, 7.40 we have to hit. I'm really, really hoping that it feels the way it should be because so many things can happen where like, I don't know, like the day befores or whatever, like it could tax you, but I'm feeling pretty good considering all things. We're gonna take some pre-workout. Uh, we had a single on bench yesterday and we hit 365 and it went really, really good. You know, I'm, I'm very happy with it. And, uh, you know, Saturday we'll hit another single and hopefully it'll actually be heavier because if you guys don't know, my, I bench, I have a single two times a week, right? One on Tuesday and then the other one's on Saturday and this, uh, the one on Saturday is post deadlifts. You know, I'll have deadlifts first and then I'll have bench. And typically Saturday we'll have about 10 to 15 pounds more on bench, it seems like. So we'll see. Since we hit a, you know, 365 bench, I might have said 265 on accident. So we hit a 365, and uh, we'll see on Saturday. Hopefully, we can hit maybe a tied PR of 375 or maybe a 380 to 385. Who knows? Then we'll probably be towards the end of the block, and then we'll probably start a new mesocycle, but I'm not sure yet. But we're going to focus on today. 740 deadlift we'll take some pre-workout which i'll show you what i'll be taking and we'll just kind of get like in the zone you know I, I just didn't spend too much time thinking about the lift today just because i don't want to have it taxed you know some people like will have it where they think about the lift the entire time and i don't like doing that because i feel like by the time i get up to the bar i'm taxed and i don't want that you know i want to be as refreshed and like just ready to go until 740 pounds is on the bar and then I'm like okay hey it's go time you know so we're gonna pick up Nate and we're gonna go hit the gym three pills of Gorilla Mind Rush four Gorilla Mind Smooth and we got six Gorilla Mind AR I'm gonna take these all right now just because we have about a 15 minute car ride to the gym and I also have to pick up Nathan so I'm guessing guesstimating about 35 to 40 minutes and you want to have that before it kicks in so you know let's say 30 minutes and go to the gym warm up's going to take about 15 minutes we should be getting it kicked in real soon you guys see that that was a champ move all right so i haven't really talked about my whole injury thing uh, i made a video on it but I didn't really talk about too much like with how recovery's been, right? And it, it's been going well, considering all things. When I did have this somewhat of an injury, I it was very, very hard for me to get into my deadlift stance. It was a little bit more uh, painful to do that and everything else. And that was two weeks before my meet. I did my meet, all that stuff. We've had this whole protocol, but my hamstring is still a little uh, sensitive, right? So I have my... Uh, my little massage gun, Theragun, whatever you want to call it, Hypervolt, uh, in the back seat because I still use it to get warmed up because I have this just uh, just this slight little thing, you know? And uh, it, it's better. It's way better than it, it's ever been, right? But, you know, I can't tell if it's, like, still at 100%, so I'm always just taking precaution, you know? But just wanted to give you guys, like, a quick update on that because that's something I think a lot of people have been wondering, too they've asked me if I'm still injured so no I'm not thankfully knock on wood but uh we're still healing from it you know 
We're also going to add 10 pounds. I woke up today and I was 200 and I was 220.8 pounds, so close to 221. I'm going to bed at like 223, 224-ish, which is nice. Soon we're going to make that our everyday weight. And, uh, yeah, I'm super excited for this future, you know. Lots and lots of stuff to work on. But uh, let's get this deadlift session in. Did you guys go canoe? No, Ben did. Oh, you get, oh. We didn't, we dropped it off at the park for Ben. They're doing like a team building. But he, he, he pulled one. Oh, I thought you were going to take my canoe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I thought, Tiny, were you taking it? <laughs> you want to say hi? Who am I saying hi to? See, see that thing? It just fits perfectly. Now, any small bump is going to make this thing just collapse down. I did my pre while you were talking with Opage. Okay. I'm debating on whether I go to the grocery store because I forgot my juice. But I have chocolate milk in there. You know, but usually I have both. Yeah. What do you have today? I have deadlifts. Big number. The juice. You forgot it at home or are you just out of them? I'm just out of them. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> is what do you do mm, indeed right what do you do i might just say uh whatever and then you know eat a little more when i get home you know just sip on my chocolate milk throughout my workout i'd puke i couldn't it's not too bad okay like you know, you're you, used to it now the only thing you have to worry about is the explosive diarrhea in the toilet yeah that makes sense we dropped it oh. So I'm back in my house. We did 720. That was fine. Not the numbers I wanted to hit. I wanted it. It was programmed for 750, but I don't know. Lockout felt weird. I think I'm not going to be wearing the notorious lifts. 
I'm going to be ditching those for a little bit just because uh, they're seeming, seeming to get a little looser. So it's hard for me to figure out my stance with them. So I think that's a big problem with it is my stance is actually just a little bit different. You know, my 675, I noticed that I put way too much pressure on like my toes. So I was like way more leaning forward coming up. So I lost a lot of strength that way. I was like, what the hell, you know, but, um, I got a lot to work on. We have a big squat Friday. So hopefully that goes better when I eat some food, food is going to be the key to, uh, getting stronger. But I, as you can tell though, I'm, I'm, I'm a little disappointed, you know, I'm a, like, I, I, I don't know if it's like, I'm just out of energy or if I'm just tired or if I'm just like, ah, but like, I couldn't even get mad. I was just like, damn, ouch, you know? So I'm just going forward. I'm going to be looking more forward to Friday and hopefully we can hit a good number. Uh, just feeling a little taxed, you know, but that's all right. It's all right. So I'm gonna go eat some food. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I don't know exactly when this will be posted, but yeah. If you guys aren't subscribed, check it out. Subscribe, comment below. This is the entire journey. You guys are following me because you guys want to see me deadlift. I don't know. Hopefully a thousand pounds in the next four years or so. Could happen, could not happen. I don't know. We're just going with the flow, right? Everything's been working pretty much in my favor. Uh, and I like to record these ups and downs because I think it's it's a good uh, good showing you that it's not all about PRs and joy. You know, we do have training days that suck, and I think those are the most people most people that can uh, kind of resonate with. You know, they're like, oh hey, you know, social media is all fake and stuff, so you can't you never can tell when a person feels down or whatnot. So that's the point of these YouTube videos is to give you a sense of what my emotion levels are like. But yeah. We'll come back. We'll smoke it. You know, I'm somewhat happy I didn't get injured. You know, it moved fine. It just it just wasn't there today, and that's fine. So I have something I can get a little looking forward to next. You know, I'm like, okay, hey, we're, we're gonna have a rematch. You know, with that deadlift, I'll be like, hey, dude, 750 is mine. Gosh, I'm tired. Okay, bye, guys.